All right, well, Bradley Wiggins, uh, maybe no surprise that you're not starting today's stage in the green jersey. Yeah, I mean, it was always going to happen, really. I was just kind of keeping it warm for pretty much whoever won the stage yesterday and it happened to be Cav, so I'm sure he'll hold it for some time now. Let's talk about that finish yesterday. Tyler Farrar, obviously second. Uh, what was your role in that lead out? Uh, to be honest, nothing really. Um, a lot of the guys were looking after me and Christian yesterday, keeping us out of trouble, keeping us hydrated. It was a really hot day and we got through quite a few bottles. But um, yeah, just obviously Julian was designated to look after Tyler with Martin and they did a great job and they tried to work a little bit off Columbia because obviously Columbia hit the front with their full team and I mean Tyler proved again you know he's in the ballpark to win something like that and as this race goes on and maybe tie, Cav tires or gets dropped in the final that Tyler could could quite easily win a stage here so it's great news for the team. Yeah we haven't had a chance to talk to Tyler on the one hand he's got to be happy with second and his first tour sprint on the other hand it looked like he was more or less in perfect position to come around if he could. Yeah but you know I mean Cavs proved when he's when he's getting slung shot like that he's the fastest man in the world and pretty untouchable as Fabian is in the time trial so uh, you know persistence hopefully will pay off for Tyler. So we see the Garmin team with the radios on the helmet that's an unusual look I haven't seen that before tell me about that yeah I mean we've got some sort of new skin tight aero jersey so uh, it's getting difficult obviously with your food in there and to get a radio in as well in the back it makes it quite uncomfortable so helmet seemed uh, an easy place to have it you know kind of carry around on your head and at the back of the helmet so we're just trying out yesterday was the first day of actual road racing of the tour what can you tell me a little bit about the feeling in the peloton was it more nervous than normal um, it was quite nervous um, but not as nervous as I think everyone imagined I think with Lance back, everyone imagined Lance to be really stressing and kind of staying in the front with his whole team and we didn't see Lance all day. He seems super relaxed at the moment, um, which is kind of rare really because, you know, three or four years ago it was kind of stress fest with the whole of Discovery running in the front. But no, yesterday was pretty relaxed for a first stage. It was quite a tough stage, um, but obviously, yeah, we'll, we'll see how the next few days goes. One last question. With the team time trial tomorrow, is that going to affect at all the way that the, the, the favorite teams for that stage race today? Uh, possibly, but it didn't yesterday. We saw Saxo riding most of the day yesterday, Columbia in the final. So uh, they had a pretty tough day yesterday, and maybe they'll, they'll do the same today again. But um, I don't think anyone's really thinking of tomorrow yet. It's kind of trying to just take it a day at a time, and today's going to be a tough day. All right, well, thanks for the time, Bradley. Thanks.